Necessary for food safety. Thermometer displays true oven temperature instantly to ensure safe food preparation. Extreme temperature range. Thermometer reads between 60 degrees and 580 degrees degrees Fahrenheit 20 degrees and 300 degrees degrees Celsius. Perfect for any kitchen. Designed for professional kitchens with the highest quality in mind. Works perfectly in any home or commercial space. Many uses. This product is perfect for traditional ovens, toaster ovens, grills, smokers, or any heat-based food appliance. Durable material. Stainless steel construction and shatterproof lens makes this thermometer highly dependable. Battery-free design. Mechanical thermometer reads instantly and without the need for battery power. Can be installed hanging or standing. National Sanitation Foundation certified. This NSF certified product has been cleared for safe use with food and in kitchen environments. Top reviews from the United States. This is my second one, for a friend. It works. In my old house I had one of these Bekasu my oven was so far off of the preheat settings. On that oven, it was 55 degrees too low, according to the oven setting. Depending on the temperature, it could be off as much as 60 degrees when done preheating. My new house the oven works perfectly, but it's a new house and oven, so it should. Dot but a friend of mine is having the same but opposite issue with her oven. So I thought I'd help her out. At only 10 bucks it totally worth it to not ruin food or not knowing how something is going to turn out. Baking is hard enough without having an extra unknown variables, out of your control. Because my first one, same brand and model of thermometer worked so well, I wanted to buy her this one. Her over is super over cooking food. She said she puts things in for half the time, but that's not the answer. Cooking at the correct temp and the correct time is the answer. This will show, exactly how hot her oven is really getting. I suspect it's about 50 to 70 degrees hotter than it should be. These work well, I never had any problems with the first one, but I left it for the people that lived there after me to deal with. If you don't have the money for a new oven or oven thermostat, here's an intermediate step that works with a little testing.